This is Tree from Stitches TV in London. We are going to create a new trend. Apron skirts, come on, apron skirts. All you have to do is you get two ready-made aprons, okay? You just got to join them together at the back. Now you can do that by hand or using your sewing machine. And then you simply tie them so you get two little bows at the back and you've immediately got a really wicked wrap around apron skirt. We're gonna make aprons cool. Now you can get aprons from Walmart, Target, and then what you can do is, when you get them, if you like, you can sort of jazz them up a little bit with some fantastic haberdashery. Right, really, I know that you may be thinking that aprons are not cool, but you know what, we're gonna make them cool. Julia Childs, eat your heart out. Right, now I've got these two gorgeous vintage aprons. Well, I don't know, they look like that they've been made out of some vintage tablecloth. Now I'm gonna show you how you would tie them. So you get the first one, and you've got to make, if it has a pocket at the front, it's usually better if it has. Make the pocket full at the side, and then you need to have the edge of the apron to fall near the back, because you're gonna be stitching that up. Now tie that in a little bow, at the back, just like that. And then get your second apron. And remember, you're gonna have to position the pocket on the side, so let's do that, whilst wrapping the front around. I'm gonna tie that, I mean, you can tie it however you want, it's just I think it looks really cute with two little bows at the back. Can you see that, viewers? I don't know, can you see it? Yep. Right, so tie that in a little bow at the back. And then I would stitch along there. So I'm just stitching in one place, which can be by hand or by machine. Now look at that. That is totally fantastic. Imagine that with some black leggings so that the lace really shows up. So today I'm gonna make an apron out of two slightly contrasting aprons so that they look a bit edgy. Now remember, you can put totally different aprons together. I think it looked quite surreal and cool. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just line them up so that they're definitely overlapping at the back. And for me, I'm going to stitch just along this line here on my sewing machine. And I'm gonna trace out where I've got the stitching already on there. Now, if you've already watched any of my Stitches TV videos, you'll know I never, ever use pins. I don't mind you using a little bit of Bonder Web, but never use pins. Right, so I'm gonna take it to the machine now. It's only this distance here, we're gonna be fine. So, I'm taking it to the machine. Now, you could do this by hand, remember, you people that don't use sewing machines. I'm gonna go backwards and forwards, and I'm just gonna trace out with my rather noisy sewing machine that needs a bit of oil. That seam, I'm gonna come all the way down. And then I'm gonna stop where the frill is underneath. Backwards and forwards when I stop, take it off, and then let's have a look. Right, so you can see where I've sewn, you can see what's going on, that's the back. So essentially, we've ended up with a wonderful wrap-around skirt. Now I'm gonna show you how to tie this one on the dummy. So what you need to do is you need to line up the center seam at the back and make sure that the pockets are at the side. So I'm wrapping it round. Now, what you have to do, make sure you've got the same color or the same tie thing, otherwise it doesn't work. So I'm tying that in a bow on one side, like that. Tying a bow. And then I'm doing the same on the other side, making sure I've got the ties that belong to each other together, like that, and then you end up with two gorgeous bows at the back, and look, fantastic pockets and a wrap around at the front. So, come on, let's start with trends, Fred Bangers. Two aprons makes a gorgeous wrap around skirt. Apron skirts, apron skirts for the summer. Come on, let's start a trend. If you can't find a nice apron out there, which I find really hard to believe, do you know what? Go to Stitchless TV channel, because I've got a fantastic video of how to make a brilliant apron. What do you think, Threadbanger viewers? 
If you want to see any more of my videos, go to Stitchers TV channel on YouTube. Bye! <laughs>